Inksoft released a video showcasing closed beta gameplay for Throne and Liberty. The video, which was conducted internally, features world exploration, a character creator, and lodge scale encounters with world bosses and castle sieges that involve player versus player combat. Alongside the video, Inksoft also released a new story map that gives more information about the game's setting, characters, and plot. Throne and Liberty's character creator is shaping up to be quite robust at launch, offering players a range of options commonly found in Korean morks. These options include changes to hair, as well as more nuanced and subtle changes to smaller parts of the face and hair length, ensuring that no two characters will look the same. After reviewing some gameplay of Throne and Liberty, it becomes evident that the game centers around large-scale action. The closed beta footage of the game provides a glimpse of intense and exciting open-world boss content that is available to anyone to participate in. These bosses can be found scattered throughout the game world. As previously demonstrated, players will have access to various mobility options to navigate the game world. One such option is the use of a grappling hook, which allows players to traverse the environment quickly. Additionally, players can also ride giant flying creatures known as land whales to travel through the sky. Another mobility option is the shapeshifting mount system, which allows players to transform into flying all and base creatures to move around. Exploring the story map by clicking on various items, players can discover information about monsters, boss encounters, character introductions, and episodic stories that reveal the history, discoveries, and more of the game world. If you're interested in the lore and background of the game, the story map is a great place to start. Overall, Throne and Liberty appears to be a promising addition to the MMORPG genre.